Hello, folks, and welcome to Conan Exiles with Esmigan. Hold on. So, yeah, I haven't played this game for almost two years, I think, and it's one of my favorite, if not my top favorite, survival crafting game. Uh, I really love this game a lot. I have, as of current, or oh, just short of 100 hours in it, which some people would say, like, oh, well, I have a thousand hours in this game. Well, I have uh, nearly a million hours in this game. But for me, with how busy my schedule is and how often I have to do so many other things per day, I, I have very jam-packed days. It's amazing that I have 100 hours in any game. So, on top of not having played this game in a while and wanting to get back to it because I recently played Ark Survival of all to my friends, and it didn't hit the same the same way Conan Exiles always did. I also wanted to kind of record the series and make like a series of videos where I just play a game I really have fun with, do some fun editing, fun little videos to upload maybe on a semi-daily basis for you guys to enjoy. And if it doesn't end up being popular, that's perfectly fine. Just fun, fun little fodder for the channel to get a regular upload in, hopefully. So anyway, hope you enjoy my Conan Exiles journey. And let us begin. Conan! What is best in life? To crush your enemies, see them driven before you, and to hear the lamentation of your women. Alright, first things first is connect stone. Mine! Can't forget about the fiber and seeds and- Oh, there be fighting over there! I don't remember those things. What the fuck is that thing? The fuck is that thing? It's a chungus! Don't need to get into a f involved in fights that aren't my concern! Ooh, twig! Alright, so after collecting a series of twigs and rocks, <clears throat> I now have myself an axe. So let's get a chop into them trees, man. Oh, yeah. It's always good to watch them trees fall. <laughs> I'm a lumberer at heart. Alright, now I got myself a pickaxe. So, stone for days, boys. Stone for days. Fuck. Leave me be! Owl creature! No, bad. Bad crocodile. Bad. Ah! <laughs> Leave me alone. Leave me alone. I don't have a weapon. <laughs> Leave me alone. <laughs> no, please. Uh, how far will he, ch will he chase me a ways? I can't remember how, like, the aggro does in this game. <laughs> Back off, man. They look like I, uh, I'm entertaining you. Just because my booty is delicious does not mean you get to chow down. You gotta buy my dinner first, at least. He is a persistent dickhead. Okay. Okay, I see how it- okay. Rock it hard place, rock it hard place. Oh shit. Oh shit! I was just grabbing aloe real quick while he was chasing me, but... The they ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine, when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would- Okay. Good, I, I led him into a trap. That's right, motherfucker, you get what you deserve. Getting bullied by bigger, uh, bigger meat, as they say. <laughs> oh shit. Oh shit, they killed him fast. Almost feel bad for the for the crocagator or alligator, whatever the fuck he is. I mean, brick to my my collection. Looks like an alien. Eh, I'm too stupid to ask questions about that. Actually, in all in all curiosity though, like hardcore like Conanites or Conan fans, uh, because admittedly, like I, I just know the movies and some things about Robert E. Not Robert E. Lee. Um, but I, I know some things about like the comic creator and uh, the comics a little bit, as well as the short stories. Like I know a little bit. I, I would say I, I, if I had to do, rank myself, I'm like normie slightly plus when it comes to my knowledge of Conan. That being said, I don't have incredibly in depth knowledge. So if if any if if anyone has like extra information, they, this could just be stylization from Funcom for the game. But if this is something established in Conan lore, which I know is pretty expansive, hit me up in the comments. Uh, I'd love to I'd love to hear any bits of information that I don't know. This is this is a good exper experience to learn about Conan that I don't already know. The fuck is that thing? It's pretty brave trying to take on the. There, okay, it's dead. Oh, shit, the babies. Don't come over here, babies. Don't, because you'll bring mama, and mama will kill me. Mama will kill me, man. No, stop approaching. Stop approaching. Stop approaching. All right, after careful and detailed effort of crafting like a master, I have finally acquired clothing. I know, I look amazing. I totally crafted this. Do not look behind me. They have nothing to do with my current attire. Nothing at all. Oh shit, his body's still here. Did they not despawn? 
Eh, fuck it. There it is. Give me your hide. Yeah, considering how fast they killed that alligator, they'd probably kill me either just as fast or even faster. And I don't want to die, man. I don't want to die. I want to live. I want to build a house, so let's get some rocks. Yeah, I don't want to build over here. I want to build further down. All right, we'll, we'll go this way. One eternity later. Can I add some doors here? There we go. Noise, noise, carefully. <laughs> I shake I need more fiber. Fiber, I say. I see a living thumbs over the hour. <laughs> Can you believe they convicted me of murder? Absolutely ridiculous, don't you think? I mean, I'm such a friendly guy. I have a shot. Warming myself by the fire. Keeping warm with lovely company. That's painful to look at from the outside. I need to finish that roof. Alright, place down a bed. So, this should be home for now. Ah, shit. Fuck, another one. Come here, you bitch. Call me Ninja Gaiden, because I know how to work this shit. Ow! You're hurting me. You're hurting me bad. I did not give you permission. Whew. <laughs> Clearly, a very one-sided fact. Actually, damn. He's a chunky boy. But he's my chunky boy now. <laughs> Good thing I left the roof open. And I'm going to put the box of stuff there. And I was going to put another one there, but I can wait for another time. Alright, goal for today as the sun rises. Finish my fucking roof. I see potential friends over there. And not victims, I swear. Alright. Let's finish this building. And the final touch on my roof. If it off. Hey, there he goes. Huzzah! And they said I couldn't build houses. I was only good for murdering. Well, little did they know, I could do two things. Ha <laughs> ha! Actually, how's it look on the outside? Does it look good? I hope it does. Oh, it's a nice little hut. It's my hut, though. It's a good my hut. I'll expand upon it. I'm gonna add furniture. I'm gonna have a good time. I'm gonna bring my friends. I'm speaking of, if I'm gonna bring friends over, I'm gonna need a wheel of friendship. Hey, well, that's gonna do it for episode one of my Conan Exile Survivalist series with Asthma Gone. I need to workshop that title. But I have had fun. I am enjoying myself, and hopefully you guys will enjoy these as I go along. They're not going to be super long, I don't think. Some episodes will probably be longer than others. It'll all come down to, like, the amount of time it takes to edit and, like, free time and stuff like that for putting it all together in a fun little ride. But, yeah, it's hopefully going to become a semi-regular upload on the channel for you guys to enjoy. And if it's not your cup of tea, feel free to check out the other content on the channel, which is fairly 40k-focused. And I say that, f I say fairly when it, it is 40k-focused for the vast majority of it. But this is a fun little easy-to-upload series that I think you guys will enjoy. So, uh, yeah, check it out uh, going forward. And if it's not your cup of tea, there's so much more on the channel I offer. So hopefully you guys will check it out, including the Voxwork podcast with my two best friends, Nico and Nathan. So, um, yeah. Anyway, that's it for me. See you guys next time. Bye-bye.